In this tutorial, we will solve one easy problem and one two-step problem on the perimeter of rectangles. Welcome to Home Campus, the Singapore Maths YouTube channel. Here you will learn math concepts in a fun and easy way. Please click on the like and subscribe button below. By subscribing, you will be notified when we upload new math videos. If you want us to solve your homework questions, leave a comment down below. Alright, now let's dive straight into this tutorial. Here is our first problem. Rectangle A has a perimeter of 30 cm. Find the breadth of rectangle A. Let's recall from a previous tutorial that the perimeter of a rectangle is 2 times the sum of its length and breadth. Click the link above if you need to refresh your memory. Back to our example, the perimeter of rectangle A is 30 cm, which means that 2 times length plus breadth is equal to 30 cm, or length plus breadth will be 30 divided by 2, and that will be 15 cm. Now we know that the length of the rectangle is 8 cm, that's given to us. Therefore, the breadth will then be 15 minus 8 or 7 centimeters. That's how you solve this problem. On to the next problem. Alice has a string that is 54 centimeters long. She uses the string to form a rectangle whose longer side is 18 centimeters. How long is the shorter side of the rectangle? Let's look at the details in this question. Alice makes a rectangle using a string and the string is 54 centimeters long. This tells us that the distance around the rectangle that she formed is 54 centimeters. In other words, the perimeter of the rectangle is 54 centimeters. The second detail in the question is that the longer side is 18 centimeters. In a rectangle, the longer side is called the length. So, the length of the rectangle is 18 centimeters. What we have to find out is how long the shorter side is. In other words, we have to find the breadth or the width or the other side of the rectangle. Now, all we really have to do is plug the numbers in the perimeter formula to find the unknown piece. It's similar to what we did in the previous question. Perimeter is 2 times length plus breadth, which is 54 centimeters. So length plus breadth would be 54 divided by 2 or 27 centimeters. We know that the length is 18 centimeters, that's given to us. So the breadth will then be 27 minus 18 or 9 centimeters. Hence, the shorter side of the rectangle is 9 centimeters. That's it for now. Check out some of these videos to learn how to solve difficult problems on perimeter. Go ahead and download free worksheets at homecampus.com.sg and practice some questions to become perfect. Website link is in the description below. Keep learning with Home Campus Singapore Math.